To tell us how the Institute of Acoustics has been able to continue to support its members during the COVID-19 pandemic, here's Stephen Turner. Hi, Stephen. So how has the Institute of Acoustics been able to reach its members during COVID-19? When the Institute moved to its new offices in Milton Keynes, those arranging it had the foresight to install some good video conferencing facilities using Zoom. And we were able to build on that to keep in touch with our members who suddenly find themselves isolated or on furlough. And it provided a means to keep in touch with each other. We organised weekly forum meetings on a Monday um, with no specific agenda, just invited people to drop in. And they did. We had about 75 at a maximum, usually about 40 or 50 each week. And what was interesting is I don't think we ever had the same people each time. And I think we reached out to about two or 300 members overall, discussing a whole range of matters from work-related matters, how to cope with the government, grant schemes, through to acoustic issues and so on. And the membership seemed to enjoy it. What we also did was ran a series of what we called CPD refresher training, which were lectures of about one hour on a particular topic that is still currently relevant. So rather than asking the speakers to write a whole new talk, it was presentations they'd previously given either at an IOA one day meeting or at an IOA branch meeting. And we invited members for free to attend this and they have proved remarkably popular, not just in the UK, but we had members in Hong Kong, South Africa, India and Canada. And they have proved, as I said, very popular. And although the sessions have finished at the moment for the summer, we are going to look to see if there is demand to continue them in the future. Thank you, Stephen. <laughs>